Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back to Solinux Crypto. Hope you're all doing great. And welcome to this new uh, emergency update on Solana. Uh, I wanted to cover it again. I covered it this morning, but then the uh, the analysis was kind of inconclusive, right? Because uh, if, if you remember, if you saw the video, uh, what I said is that Solana, well, was very bullish, but it reached a significant resistance level with this orange line, uh, which was the 1.618 FIB of the move down after FTX. So that's a very significant Fibonacci level. That's a move that happened everywhere, almost the same. So the 1.618 naturally, like that's a very strong Fibonacci extension. And coming from that Fibonacci sequence, that's uh, not the correct way to say it, but all right, coming from that uh, specific Fibonacci, it's, it's, it's strong. So what I said is that we would have to wait for either $58 to break out or $54 to break out, and then we would know more. And uh, what has happened is that Solana got that bullish breakout above $58. Uh, so that's where we are right now. I mean, you can see on the one hour time frame, uh, Solana is strong, found some resistance here at, uh, at around $64. When I made the video this morning, uh, and you can still see the title, my main price target was uh, $67. In my eyes, there's basically this entire like resistance zone between $75 and $67. And $67 is the first price target there, of course. Uh, so that was my price target, all right? Now, the main question now is, can it still get there? And I think the, the obvious answer is a yes. Um, there is a ton of bullish momentum coming in uh, coming into Solana right now. Now, I also know that some, uh, I, I believe some staked soul tokens were about to uh, be released. The open interest was growing practically in the, the entire morning. It has ever since dropped down a bit. So some positions were closed. So it is true and you can also see that with the one hour time frame candle that it has lost some momentum. But I think the the main test is what we will see in the next couple of hours, all right? Because right now, even though the open interest has fallen down a bit, it's still super high. Solana still is very bullish. I don't necessarily see Bitcoin dropping down dramatically uh, or drastically today or dramatically, whatever you want. So I think the main level to watch really is $60, all right? 60 slash 58. So we're going to flip this. I think this is the main level. If Solana is able to hold $60 with this next four hour time frame candle, uh, which probably has already closed by the time you're watching this video, I see no reason why Solana would not continue going up higher. Um, like on the daily time frame, like I said, it's uh, it's it's really a big level with with a lot of different uh, with a lot of different support and resistance levels. You could even draw it all the way up here to eighty dollars. Uh, we won't do that, but that's re really the main level. And you can also see right here historically, there's also you know sixty dollars is also respected as a level. So that's the main thing to watch, I think. All right, because if Solana, like I said, if on the four hour time frame, it's able to hold that level. Uh, and find support at 60 slash 58 dollars. I think 60, 58, as long as it stays above that uh, for the next 24 hours, or if it finds some strong support from there, I don't see a reason why Solana would not go up to 67 dollars and then uh, potentially afterwards up to 70, 72, 75, etc. Um, so that's the main thing to watch. And I would say it's most likely that it will hold. It's obviously better to, to wait for that confirmation, wait to see if it actually holds, because if it doesn't, like if, if Solana right now uh, does not hold $58, $58 as, as support, it's going to drop down to $54, but probably even lower down towards 50 and sub $50 levels. So this is a possibility. Now, given the market circumstances and given the amount of momentum that Solana has, I wouldn't say this is most likely, but like I said, it's best to wait until Solana is able to hold that level around $60 and get some support from that or not. All right. So I think that's what you need to know for now. That's my emergency update. Emergency update always is a little bit of clickbait, but all right, uh, for now, that's my take. All right. So lastly, as you can see around the screen, I have my own uh, Signal group and premium group. I think they're the best groups out there on YouTube, but obviously I'm biased. If you want to make some profits or become a better trader, consider joining those, but the links to that will be down in the description, all right? I won't bother you with them anymore. Check that out if it sounds interesting. For now, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.